How to skin flood with Korean skincare. First, start with a clean face. This method works really great if you have damp skin. So after you cleanse, you're gonna go in with your toner or essence. I'm using an essence here, but it's very liquidy, so it reminds me of a toner, and we like to layer this on. In Korea, there's a popular trend called Seven Skin. It's a method whereby you apply your toner seven times in a row, row 30 second increments, and you're basically flooding your skin with so much hydration. Of course, you wanna let it kind of dry a little bit, but as soon as it kind of feels a little dry, you go in with the next layer. I'm not doing seven layers, but I'm going to go in with three layers of this SNC toner. Second, we're gonna go in with a hyaluronic acid serum. As you know, in Korea, retinol or other strong actives has never been a very you know, popular ingredient in Korean skincare. Korean skincare has always been about hydration, 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 and gentle, natural exfoliants like rice that can exfoliate your skin from the surface. But overall, we're just focused on hydration. So just going to go in with one to two layers of the serum. Optional, if you have some time, you can go in with a sheet mask after that serum step. Lastly, right when the serum is about to dry up, we're gonna go in with some moisturizer. And if your skin is feeling really dry, you can mix in a few drops of oil. I love a nice calming oil like this. Layering is key when you have dry skin. So there are a lot of days when I go in with two layers of moisturizer. Sometimes with skin flooding, you're layering just hydration on top of each other. And it can even total up to like 10 layers at the end of the night.